SAPERP Interview Questions and Answers Question 1. What is SAPERP? Answer. SAPERP Enterprise Resource Planning is an integrated software suite developed by SAP AG, which helps organizations manage their business operations effectively. It covers various business functions such as finance, human resources, procurement, production, sales, and more, providing a centralized platform for real-time data processing and decision-making. Question 2. What are the key modules in SAP ERP, and can you briefly describe them? Answer. SAP ERP offers various modules, including SAP FI Financial Accounting manages financial transactions, accounting, and reporting. SAP CO Controlling supports cost and management accounting. SAP M Materials Management handles procurement, inventory management, and vendor relationships. SAP SD Sales and Distribution manages sales order processing, and customer relationships. SAP Hour HCM, Human Capital Management, deals with HR processes, including payroll and personnel administration. SAP PP, Production Planning, helps in production planning and control. SAP WM, Warehouse Management, manages warehouse processes and inventory. SAP PM Planned Maintenance handles equipment maintenance and asset management. Question 3. What is SAP ECC, and how is it different from S4HANA? Answer. SAP ECC ERP Central Component is the predecessor to SAP S4HANA. ECC is built on traditional relational database systems, whereas S4HANA is built on the SAP HANA in-memory database platform. S4HANA offers real-time analytics, simplified data models, and improved user experience compared to ECC. It also supports cloud deployment and is considered the future of SAP ERP. Question 4. Explain the concept of SAP HANA. Answer. SAP HANA is an in-memory, column-oriented database management system developed by SAP. It's designed to process large volumes of data in real time, allowing for faster data retrieval and analytics. HANA can be used for various purposes including as the underlying database for SAP S4HANA, as well as for data warehousing, advanced analytics, and application development. Question 5. What is the difference between SAP ECC and SAP Business Suite on HANA? Answer. SAP Business Suite on HANA is essentially SAP ECC running on the SAP HANA database. The key difference is that the business suite on HANA leverages the in-memory capabilities of HANA for faster data processing and analytics. It also provides a simplified data model and improved performance compared to ECC on traditional databases. Question 6. What is an SAP implementation project, and can you describe its phases? Answer. An SAP implementation project is the process of deploying SAP ERP software in an organization. The phases typically include project preparation, defining project scope, goals, and team roles, business blueprint, documenting business processes and system requirements, realization, Configuring the SAP system based on the blueprint. Final preparation. Data migration, testing, and end-user training. Go live and support. Launching the SAP system and providing ongoing support. Question 7. What is SAP ASAP methodology? 
Answer. ASAP, Accelerated SAP, is a methodology for implementing SAP ERP projects. It's a framework that provides guidelines, templates, and best practices for each project phase, aiming to streamline the implementation process and ensure successful outcomes. Question 8. How do you handle SAP system upgrades and patches? Answer. Upgrades and patches are critical to keeping the SAP system secure and up-to-date. The process typically involves creating a sandbox environment for testing, applying upgrades or patches, testing extensively, and then scheduling a production downtime window for the actual upgrade or patch application. Question 9. What is SAP Fiori, and how does it enhance the user experience? Answer. SAP Fiori is a user experience UX design approach and set of user interface technologies that enhance the look, feel, and usability of SAP applications. It provides a responsive and intuitive interface, making it easier for users to access and interact with SAP applications on various devices. Question 10. Can you explain the concept of SAP roles and authorization? Answer. SAP roles define sets of permissions and access rights for users within the SAP system. Authorization objects are used to control access to specific functions or data within SAP modules. Roles are assigned to users based on their job roles and responsibilities ensuring they only have access to the necessary functions and data. Remember that interview questions may vary depending on the specific SAP module or role you are interviewing for, so it's essential to prepare for questions tailored to your expertise and the job requirements. Hey everyone, if you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel, giving it a thumbs up, leaving a comment with your thoughts or questions, and sharing it with your friends. Your support means the world to us and helps us create more content like this.